Welcome to our yeah. Are you with us? Perhaps this might wake you up. seem to know who I am. Perhaps you would like to introduce yourself to me and see if I can help you on your way out of Mirkwood here. Well, it is indeed nice to make your acquaintance and go in by your look. Am I right in saying that you are Gondorin? Well, it's your attire you have there, what little is left of it, after you've no doubt been in a little scrap with something. 
You are from the kingdom of Gondor. Are you not? I do know Gondor and Lord Denethor and his son Boromir and Faramir. Though I could see why you decided to run away. Well, you seem just a little bit restless still. So please allow me to be a wizard. And I will help you feel a little bit better. Well, that's what I can do, if you'd like. And then we can either decide what to do with you and help you on your way. I do believe I know a couple of spells which might be useful to you. Well, let me try this one. You could tell me how you feel afterwards. Let's get you a little bit back to good health, shall we? Okay. You may hear something in your ear. say that you look a little bit better as if you've just finished an evening off at your local inn hmm. well my name is Gandalf the Cray and you are in Mirkwood and I would say you are on the borders though I would believe that you have made your way quite far into Mirkwood, but there are worse places which you can find yourself. Here in Mirkwood, despite, let's just say, the unfriendliness of Tarantral, King of the Elves here in Mirkwood, that you find yourself surrounded in one of the most beautiful places here on Middle-earth. I understand why you decided to come out here, though I feel like you don't even remember getting there, do you? No, you don't. We can help you with that, don't you worry. No, I do believe that you might benefit from the help of a wizard. Let's just say that I might be able to help guide you through Mirkwood and should you wish perhaps visit King Fandriel and ask for his permission to travel through his territory so hopefully we can get you fed some food some lambless bread and get you back on your way that's the advantages of having a wizard with you it's a free ticket round middle earth can do something else. I can help you relax a little bit more. I can help you feel a little bit more at ease. Perhaps do 
you a little spell which will make you not invisible but undetectable to the hours and you could leave on the morn of tomorrow and you can go back to Gondor but if you decide to do that I can help you relax now and send you to sleep where you will be able to rest and wake up feeling like you've been helped by a wizard well I must say that both options do sound appealing to me oh why don't I put a protective spell on you anyway and then perhaps I can help you through tomorrow morning through Mirkwood and get you back to where you belong Mirkwood is not best of places to be by yourself they say there are some spells that are being cast around here which confuse the mind and make you forget where you have come from and who you are sound familiar no doubt that is what has happened to you well, I'm going to help you relax just a little bit more my staff will do most of the work here you may hear just a little bit of tingly sounds in your left ear and then again in your right so these sounds should be very soothing and relaxing for you and I assure you that afterwards you decide to fall asleep or just feel good in general being in the presence of a wizard I'm sure you would consider that to be lucky anyway As promised, these spells should help you feel a lot better, shall we say, and get rid of those spells that you most likely picked up traveling through Merwood. I see that it has clouded your mind, so this is to help you restore your memory and get you back on your feet. Let us continue.
That seems to have poked you up a little bit. Yes, this is one of the many spells that us wizards here on Middle Earth can perform. You should count yourself lucky. It's not every day you should perform in the hands of a wizard. Of course, there are. There are five of us in our order. I am Gandalf the Grey. There is Radagrass the Brown. There is the two wizards, the Gloomers, or somewhat forget their names, and the head of our order, Saruman the White. He is master over on Isengard at Isengard somewhere where I would not recommend going there but he is the most powerful of our order though I find that he would not let's just say help people like you though I do believe that it's just the smallest of things can make us feel better and relax more. And I've noticed in the world of men there's a lot of stressful things going on in Middle Earth. And we could all do with a little bit of, let's say, old Toby. Or head down to the nearest inn and enjoy ourselves. Well, I am actually on my way. You may not have heard of it before, but I'm heading to a place called the Shire. Heading to Bag End to visit an old friend for a birthday party. Though my route takes me through the elves to seek counsel with the elves before I make way. I have made some inquiries about certain things. So I'm glad that we run into each other. So how about that? I just give you a little bit more of a wizard spell mm -hmm. to help you relax or fall asleep. That's your choice. If you fall asleep you will have a spell cast upon you, so you can live here perfectly rested when you wake up undetected through Mugwood. You will be surrounded by this beautiful waterfall behind us, and none of the elves will know that you are here, which will no doubt be good for you, but also good for the elves on both parties. Both will be pleased, I'm sure. So if you decide to fall asleep, then you have my blessing. And it was a pleasure to meet you. But if not, then you can join me and we shall go visit King Frandriel together. And I will guide you through Mirkwood before our journey as it's end at the end of the forest. Great.
might be deep within Mirkwood, will not detect you. I know there are fouler things in there now. I dare say orcs or goblins have been seen in these bars as of late. It is a dangerous place to find yourself in, but hopefully we will get you back to Gondor and back to where you belong. Okay, well this final detective spell I will use with my hands, I think. My staff has done a lot for today, this evening, don't you think? Yes, a wizard staff has many powers, but it is not infinite, of course, and it does take its toll. So, I'll be able to cast a spell on you, and then you can make the decision whether to come with me, and we will visit King Thandru together ask for permission to travel through his Mirkwood forest, which I'm sure we will be able to obtain all you can rest and be on your way tomorrow. But that's not something for you to decide now. I shall pop this detective spell on you now. So please try to look at me in your eyes, you might feel like you can't move or you're just a little bit relaxed. That might send you to sleep, or it might not. But that's for you to decide to. Okay. Certainly work on you now. 
So feel free to travel through Merkwood and you will be protected by a wizard's spell. You won't feel anything except the desire to press on. You are most welcome. But like I said, you can come and visit Frandrill with me. No, well, I'm not forcing you. I would not wish to visit Frandrill either if it was not absolutely necessary. Though I think you have made an exceptionally wise decision. Deciding to rest here in this beautiful place here in Merkwood. And you could fall asleep by the waterfall here. You couldn't have picked a better spot. Well, Mero, which of course is elfish word for friend. It was a great pleasure to meet you and of course to help you. So you take care of yourself. Rest easy. Be careful of the orcs when heading back to your kingdom. Try and travel in daylight and find somewhere hidden, not quite like Mugwood, but somewhere safe for you to be once you've left Mugwood and you will be fine. And you can head back to your home. Things I'm sure will change in the love soon and our great struggle will indeed be over and good things will await us once more and most certainly as I'm sure that I can guess that it would be the same for you as well great things shall await you if merely got to look of them and find yourself looking in the right direction when they come to you. Oh, I'm afraid this is the time when I must leave you. Leave you be and you can get back to your home. What was a pleasure, Melwal, to meet you. Take care of yourself and cheerio.